and French Connection member and Sabres Hall of Famer, René Robert. We ask that you please direct your attention to the sideboard as we remember the life of René Robert. Hi, I'm René Robert, and I was born in Three Rivers, Quebec. This came off from training camp, I guess. Uh, we left training camp in pretty good shape, and we had to jump on the other teams, and I think that was uh, the main key uh, for our success so far. I played in Toronto, Pittsburgh. Didn't really like Pittsburgh. Uh, I hurt my back early. The tail of the 15 game of the season in Montreal, I paralyzed for three days. <laughs> For Ken Schenkel along the boards. Right in front of Robert, scores! Connection had so much respect because of their playmaking was probably the strongest in the league then. And Rene was a kind of a leader on that line. He made Joe Bear play better and better. Every time he stepped in the ice, you know, he's going to try to score. He was driven. He brought a lot of energy that line. The bigger the game, the bigger the goal. And he had a penchant for that when it mattered, so he was good. we pay for laughter. Enrico used to say all the time, if you can't have a laugh, this life ain't worth living. Robert got the biggest laugh when he pulled out a beer and a cigar to celebrate his former teammates' love of life and love of a good party. That was pretty easy for me to say. Enrico's having a beer and, and he's probably having one right now. now. I talked to Rene uh, June 6th and uh, on the 
messenger, and that, that was the last time we, we got to talk. And a few days after, probably a week after, somebody called me and uh, told me that he had a major heart attack. So, you know, I was so surprised. You know, I mean, Rennie was always kept in shape, you know, very much. And uh, they took care of his... Uh, Rene Robert was a man who made the most of the opportunity afforded him 50 years ago and turned that into a lifelong legacy as one of the most important members of the Buffalo Sabres family.